guys, welcome back to my channel. First of all, I am definitely feeling myself today. <laughs> I don't I don't know why. Um, I don't know if it's, you know, my sponsor, the sun. I don't know if it's helping me out a little bit with my little glow situation. Can we take a moment of silence? A moment of silence just for a face. And then appreciate this hair hello. That's what we're here for, right? Okay. Thank you guys so much for subscribing to my channel. Did you subscribe? Did they, did they even subscribe? First of all, if you guys have not subscribed, I'm judging you. If you are a subscriber, then thank you so much for returning back. Today, I'm going to be reviewing this beautiful, beautiful, of course, it's my hair, but we just want to say, you know, it's a wig. For, you know, coming back to watch me review this wig, I am obsessed with this wig. I don't know if I'm going to take it off my head because honestly, I think I'm feeling myself a little too much. I think I'm going a little overboard because I'm taking pictures like Like, I don't know if I want to go book a photo shoot. I don't know if I want to go outside and accidentally, you know, go to, you know, the mall or, you know, go to like Neiman Marcus. Is there a Neiman Marcus here? You know, go out for people to see this beat. You know, girls, when you go out, or when you put makeup on, you want to like, you know, go out and be like, yeah, I mean, I look good. Millie Train. You want to go, once you look good, you just need to get out of the house. So I don't know if I want to get out because it's son who sponsored this video. Hey son, thank you. Thank you, Jesus, for sponsoring this video. But I don't know if it's just, if, should I go out? Leave in the comment section, should I go out or should I just take the makeup off and just put my hair back and go to sleep? Y'all let me know in the comment section what should I do, okay? But back to what we are all here for, the review of this beautiful wig. So stay tuned. Oh, if you're not subscribed, I'm judging you. Subscribe, comment, and like this video, okay? So this is what it looks like after I brush it out. You know, after you pluck the red roots, I would say the roots, the edges. Once you pluck your edges and stuff, you have to brush it out to make sure you get all the hair out. We're going to spray. This spray bottle has um, some oil and water. You can put, um, what do you call that? Leave-in conditioner in here. You can use just water, whatever you want to do. Ooh. And then I have this Cantu Shea Butter Leave-in Conditioner for men. Yes, it says for men. But I found that the girl one isn't as good. Like, how are they gonna make a female one for curly hair and, and not as good as men? Like, uh, hello, Cantu. So this is a Cantu one for men. And the only thing that I don't like about this is smell. It smells like cologne, but if you don't mind that and you want your curls to be popping, like this sun, hello? Then don't mind it. So what we're gonna do is we're going to spray first and then we'll get into the rest. Nikis, Nikis hair is 16 inches. It is, um, or 14. I think this is 14 or 16. One thing I do like about this hair is that it's a layer. I can appreciate any wig company that has layers. First of all, do you, I haven't done anything besides put water. Do you see this? Hello? Hello, ladies? Do you see? So next thing we're gonna do is use the Cantu for men. Cantu, if you're watching this, sponsor your girl, hello. If you don't, then that's your business. So I put about this much. Um, I don't like to put a lot of um, products when it comes to wigs and stuff because it can weigh it down and makes it look very greasy. And we don't, for, This is literally from a little bit of Cantu and water. But these curls. This brush, this brush is from the dollar store. It's a wig brush. When I tell you this makes your curls so defined, I'll show you them closer. Do you see this? You see that? I got this from the dollar store. One dollar. 
itself. This wig is 100%, 150% density. That's why you see the bounce. Hello? The bounce to the ounce. Let's do this side. OGs who know me, <laughs> the OGs who know me, y'all know I do not like brown hair. So I rinsed it black. I rinsed it black and I just bleached the knots. This is a um, 16 by four. No, it's a 13 by four. So it's ear to ear and it goes six inches back. So that means you can part it here. You can part it here. You can part it anywhere in the front that you want. And this is leave-in conditioner, like I said, and it's water. Um, this wig, if you want to get 10 inches, is $78.99, so it's $79. Um, 12 inches is $92, and 16 inches, or sorry, 14 inches is $118, basically. And 16 inches is $130. I'll leave all the information for this beautiful wig in the description box, so make sure you check it out. Again, this is a very affordable, realistic, lightweight, beautiful hair. And again, I would insert the clips, but one thing if we can nitpick um, is that when I did the um, the bleaching, some of it did come out. I'll leave a clip right here on how much I had in my hand when the can't leave out came out right here. Um, and then after that, it wasn't much. It's like the typical, you know, how much it comes out, but it ain't that big of a deal though. Listen, if you can get a wig like this that's lightweight, is that it's not heavy on your like first of all, it feels like my hair. It looks like my hair. So it is my hair, okay? So those who out there who are hating, then that's your business. But yes guys, I really I like I think I always say that's my favorite, but oh, if you're not subscribed, I'll judge you. Subscribe, comment, and like this video, okay?